Hello, welcome YouTube friends and family, fellow wisdom seekers. Um, I want to thank all those people who have subscribed and uh, who continue to support my videos and education and information. Um, I enjoy doing these videos and uh, if it helps somebody out there, um, then it's definitely a successful mission. So you guys are here to get more information about water. Um, why the water you drink is very, very important for a number of reasons. Let's, uh, let's jump in the middle, shall we? So if you're in the city, um, most of the standard places are all forcing people to leave uh, well water um, to have city water. And we all know the reason why is because, well, half the reason is because they want to make money off of it. The other half is because they say that their water provides a better nutritional uh, value, it's more pure, and you're not contaminating uh, the water system supply. Okay, well my problem is that with that is that um, you, the water that they're feeding us has fluoride in it and trace elements of other uh, chemicals that they've added into it, but the majority of it's fluoride. Fluoride is supposed to go into your body and uh, strengthen your teeth. Okay, well, it does do that, but for some, it also makes it more brittle. Uh, and we don't know what the long-term effects of fluoride is on the body or the cellular system, calcium and bones in our body we don't know what the interaction will do with that because it's never been studied that long but what we do know is that there was a guy who uh, fed a group of individuals the Jewish people uh, high doses of fluoride and we know that it caused uh, all types of problems with their system including making them docile making them um, have health problems and issues and things of that nature. Um, do your research. I'm sure you know who I'm talking about. Um, so we know that that fluoride is in high amounts, which high amounts, even though they're not feeding that to us in, in the pipes, it's high amounts in the fact that over 20, 30, 40, 50 years of you drinking it, it adds up into your body and you are what you eat. So when you're drinking this, it becomes a small building block inside of your body that your body then tries to copy or uses as a foundation piece. So if it's not supposed to be there, it's not the best thing for it and high amounts that keep building up, you're bound to have some problems with it, uh, with your health. So what you want to do is drink uh, alkaline water. If you can get pure water, get a water filter like Pure or Zero. Uh, I personally use those, they're awesome. Um, you don't need one of the Kangen machines, really. Uh, most doctors say that your pH is way too high. It causes an imbalance um, of, of uh, alkalinity in your body. So by all means, definitely go talk to your doctor before doing anything. Um, but uh, you don't need that high unless they prescribe that to you for certain reasons. In general, um, adding a pinch of uh, baking soda to your water um, or uh, lemon juice, lemon, uh, lime um, into your, your drinking water. Um, a multivitamin is good to have for your health, um, to have the various nutrients and elements. Uh, stay on your electrolytes. Um, charge your water if you can. Just take your glass or whatever water, put it in a bottle, shake it up. That gets the molecular structures moving and, and ions and things of that nature which your body use. Um, because otherwise you're just basically drinking dead water that they're, they're feeding out of the um, tap. Now I'm not saying to drink more water or less water, but I'm just saying that drinking purified water is better. Um, well water with nutrients in it is the same basically as drinking water with some vitamins. You're getting trace elements and nutrients and minerals out of them. Um, artesian wells um, have good water because they run through the elements and minerals and nutrients in the ground and then when you drink it, you're ingesting them. So essentially you're taking water that's been charged by moving through the ground. So it has energy in it, um, electrolytes, minerals, trace elements, 
and so it's energized. It's also one of the reasons why people were healthier years ago because basically every day they were drinking a, an appropriate amount of um, nutrients and minerals, minerals and trace elements every day. It's like having a multivitamin every day. Um, so that's basically about it. If you can get yourself a copper cup, I would suggest doing that, uh, putting water in there, letting it sit in there for a little while, um, and then drinking that water is good for your health. So like I said, I'm not a doctor. I'm only prescri or, uh, describing um, what works for me and what I do. This is a personal experience. Um, always consult a physician or somebody uh, if, it, if you're in a medical situation. In general, it's okay to tell people to drink more water because that's what they tell us, right? So that's about it, guys. Uh, drink your water. Be aware of what uh, what's what's going on, and um, stay stay healthy, stay wise, and uh, be blessed. All right, guys. Have a good one.